was on active duty for, for about a little over seven years, almost eight, and uh, always in the infantry. I was in the United States Air Force for 11 years. Uh, I left as rank of staff sergeant, um, and I actually separated out of Hale Air Force Base in Utah. I retired as a lieutenant colonel, but I actually entered the Army as a private in Boston, Massachusetts, and I basically served all over the world. I was a caregiver for my husband, Joe, who was in the U.S. Army. Joe became a veteran in 2011, and he used VA health care for four years um, until he passed in 2015. In the VA, you kind of feel like it's home. So regardless if you did three years, two years, if you did 25 years in the military service, it's a place you can go where, one, you have people who are just like you. We were very, very grateful for just the access to the different types of treatment that we were approved to have through the VA. I had taken the records up from my uh, retina provider. I'd taken them to VA. I talked to them and they came back and says, oh, well, you have cataracts. I, I had them taken care of years ago. I carded a lot of records back and forth. Matter of fact, I got some in my briefcase. <laughs> I had been diagnosed with like non-combat PTSD, um, but because all my mental health records were lost, um, I have nothing to support what happened or, you know, to state my claim to be able to get compensated for those medical issues. Joseph was diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma um, back in 2004. And so there was always that worry that, you know, are we getting the most optimal care because the providers aren't having time to really review his records. Go for it. I'm, I'm all for it. Uh, so I think it's, it's going to give you better care, better quality. I just think about how much that will take off of people's plates to be able to know that their records can be um, transferred, tracked from facility to facility, to you know get rid of paper. That means you start to get rid of human error, like losing papers and forgetting things. So I think that's amazing, and I think it's going to be very, very much appreciated across the veteran community. If there was one system that they could have everything just dumped into the system and to where we wouldn't have to have, you know, carry all these records or have these Excel sheets or whatever we have that, you know, has like all of our medical history when we were seen and what we were seen for. Um, it would be very helpful. To have one place with all your information, that just makes sense. That's a level of efficiency that we've just not practiced in the 25 years that I've been in uniform.